All right, so everybody knows the 3070, 3080, 3090 are coming, but please listen to me. Don't go out and sell your 2080 Ti's for 500 bucks. Don't panic. Don't go out and start selling your 20 series GPUs because you know what's gonna happen. You're gonna sell it now for a cheap price, kind of panicking. And then when the new GPUs are released, they're gonna be in limited quantities. People may not be able to get them, maybe for a few weeks and a few months. And you're gonna see those 20 series GPUs pricing either stay up or start to creep back up. So please don't sell it yet. Just wait a little bit. Let's see what happens. All right, guys, so let's get right into it. For those of us that have been around the block a few times witnessing different GPU releases, especially from NVIDIA, a lot of things that are similar happen over and over again. Of course, the new 30 series does look to be pretty awesome. They seem to be priced fairly well for the type of performance gains that we're getting over the previous generation. If you guys remember the 20 series generation, a lot of people actually held off and ended up not buying it at all because cards like their 1080 Ti's were still performing pretty close to a lot of the 20 series GPUs and at a huge price premium. I really think the price premium on something like the 2080 Ti and even the 2080 really is sort of what did the previous generation in. So now when people see that the 30 series has a lot better pricing, it's not cheaper by any means, it's not getting any cheaper, but it definitely has a lot better pricing for the performance that you're getting. I'm sure you guys saw the Nvidia keynote where they mentioned the 3070 at 499, it's gonna be faster than the 2080 Ti. When people start hearing that, they they definitely start to go pretty crazy and panic selling. There were rumors of $500 2080 Ti's on eBay and things of that nature. And if that's low, imagine what a 2080 or 2070 is going to be. That's going to be even lower if those numbers were true. But I would definitely wait and now is not the time to sell your GPU. If you had sold them before the announcement at a fairly nice price, that's a whole different story. But now that the announcement has taken place, I really don't think the time between the announcement and the actual release is going to be the best time to sell the GPUs. In fact, since there's so much speculation, pretty much this is going to be the worst time because people are going to be thinking that the new GPUs are absolutely perfect and amazing, and they may think that the GPU prices of the 20 series are going to tank even further than maybe they've witnessed it doing so already, but there's a lot that can actually happen. Let's take one scenario. Let's say when Nvidia starts shipping these cards out, which is September 17th, and then September 24th is going to be the 3090, the 17th is the 3080, of course the 3070 coming later on in October. It's possible that they may just not have a huge amount of stock and these may be back ordered for a long time, which means that more and more people who need GPUs are going to be looking still at the 20 series and that way the prices are still going to level out and stay fairly fair. They're not going to plummet in value. Of course, if Nvidia had massive amounts of GPUs available at cheap prices and everybody got them like on the 17th, that's a whole different story, but historically that's never really happened. Not to mention that the 3070, the GPU that a lot of people probably will upgrade to because of its price to performance that's not coming until October anyway so I would definitely wait um, and one more thing that's really gonna affect these prices these are just sort of the Nvidia Founders Edition prices there's a lot of third-party partners that are gonna be releasing these GPUs in fact on the market those are gonna be the ones that you see more of and as history has shown us with the last generation 20 series these have been more expensive so if the 3070 is 499 it's possible something from like EVGA or Asus, that same 3070 with maybe like a little bit beefier cooler or, or RGB or something like that, it's definitely going to be above 499 It may be closer to 599 or in the 500 range. So when people start seeing these GPUs from third party partners and they're going to be more expensive than the Founders Edition, they're going to be people that are going to be put off by the price once again and just decide to stay with their 20 series GPUs, therefore leveling out the price. So I think that sometime within the next coming months we're gonna see everything reach sort of an equilibrium I would definitely not sell any GPU now from announcement all the way to they're actually released let's see how the market actually is for these let's see how the benchmarks are how all the tests are if they truly prove to be significantly faster and cheaper than the current generation the market will fix itself and then later on you can sell your GPU in order to upgrade um, then you're gonna get sort of a much more accurate pricing because right now it's just sort of panic selling thinking that the new GPU might be great but there's a chance that we may get some more information as we get closer and that way it's not going to be sort of as perfect as we view it and some of these
these 20 series prices, including the 2080 Ti, may actually level out and not plummet as much as we think, just because historically, the previous generation all has sort of held its value fairly well compared to the newer GPUs. I know this is a little bit different case because the performance does seem to be significantly better, um, especially when you consider what the price is going to be but we don't know exactly if that's gonna be the case or not, so that's why now is not a good time to sell these. I would hold on, let the market adjust itself, have a little bit of patience, and it's possible when you do go sell your GPU after the new 3000 series are released, it's possible that then you're gonna get a much more fair price for your GPU. Of course, the best time to have sold these would have been before the announcement, that way everything was still sort of at its market value, there wasn't some crazy release like we have now with the 3070 being faster than a 2080 Ti sort of playing in people's heads but that's the situation we're in now we're in between in that sort of middle phase so hold on to your GPUs let's see sort of what happens with shipping timing availability as well as performance and then I think you probably will get a better price later on than you will now so let's see what happens and we're all pretty curious so all right guys so thank you very much for watching remember to subscribe hit that like button leave a comment below and I'll see you guys on the next video